Hey everybody, Shane here with Museo and Cine Samples, and I kind of wanted to give you a behind the scenes, you know, put, peel back the curtain a little bit on some of the inner workings of a, an announcement that has just come out about Museo's limited offer lifetime membership. And essentially what it means is it's a one-time price, heavily discounted for the entire Museo library for life. No caveats, no ifs, ands, or buts, no catch. It's just a great price for the full library, not only of Museo right now, but also of Museo going into the future. That means all content, all design updates, all new key features forever. So what does that mean? Let's jump in. Uh, right now, what we have is Museo the app as it exists. And as you can see here, I've got a bunch of kind of our favorites loaded up. Industry Brass Core, uh, we just added Industry Brass Pro. We've got a massive amount of the Cine Samples Cine series, so Cine Brass, Cine Wind, Cine Strings, and Cine Perk, all loaded into Museo already. It's a full scoring suite with orchestral samples that are, you know, the top of the top of the line. Uh, really, really great sounding stuff. Let me just browse the catalog here. This is currently what's in Museo, and you have access to all of it. Um, but the the exciting thing is is not just kind of cine samples libraries it's also the museo exclusives so as we go through you'll notice things like tina guo acoustic cello legato tina guo volume 2 her solo cello uh, apocalyptica the artist series that we just did and then you'll also see some brand new stuff that you don't recognize from our contact libraries uh, gina luciani uh, is an amazing flautist and she just did an artist series library with us that's in museo coming to contact soon but right now it's an exclusive um, and then you have some exclusives that are always just going to be in Museo and probably not contact, like our suite of electronic drum kits, a uh, hardonger fiddle, um, and some of our vintage synths, as well as some interesting instruments, quattro session strings, violins, violas, celli, and basses for intro and motif writing, uh, studios drums and grand pianos that we've done in famous stages you know all around LA we went to sunset studios for these we went to village studios and got drums and mallets we've designed our own synthesizers pads and arps and basses and we're going to continue to do that we've got 73 key roads um that which sounds phenomenal and favorites like piano and blue so right now museo is just a really great instrument um, and it's all loadable by articulation and really, really incredible. Um, but this lifetime museo access that, that we're offering is going to do way more than just what's in here right now. It's not a product that's just stagnant that you have to pay for an upgrade later. Uh, with this offer, you're going to get it for life. I cannot stress that enough. You're going to get it for life. So um, what's to come? That is the exciting thing. So let me show you a bit of what we have planned on the roadmap for this year alone. Um, we are going to be getting in by the end of the summer, the rest of the Cine series line, all pro libraries, all auxiliary libraries is now going into Museo. So it's not only a full orchestral suite, suite it's an extended orchestral suite with all sorts of really um, pro level articulations and, and just incredible stuff. Um, we're going to include the rest of our library that we haven't included in Museo. We're porting it all over as we speak, and we should be done by late summer, uh, as well as extras from our artist series and um, some new exciting stuff that's just Museo exclusive as well. So as I scroll through this, you're going to see a bunch of our classic libraries that have made a name for themselves, but you're also going to see some new and exciting libraries. Uh, we recorded a vocal library with the group Vaches 8, and we have ensemble as well as split section uh, articulations with them plus legatos for each one really beautiful sounding stuff uh, a whirly electric piano we went to sonic fuel studios and recorded an upright and of course if you've been following us on social media we did our world tour last year and that includes uh, tonal and percussion instruments and vocals uh, in some cases for ireland scotland iceland and Africa. It was a great project and we had a lot of fun doing it and we're going to be getting that content exclusively into Museo by the end of the summer. Um, including, you know, Icelandic vocals and African vocals. I'm really excited about those. Uh, as well as those big ones, we're going to be jumping into um, 
are all, all the content that we captured at the Vintage Synth Museum. So old vintage synthesizers that you know cost thousands of dollars and are really rare. We went to the Vintage Synth Museum and captured those key presets and those really iconic sounds from the 70s and 80s. And we got a ton of them. As I scroll through, you can kind of see what we've gotten. Drum machines, synthesizers, synth basses, all sorts of stuff that just gives you the, the vintage vibe that you need. And of course, finishing out strong with Tina Guo Erhu. So uh, that is for the content. That's what's coming up. And that's just planned for this year in the next four or five months. So we're excited to get that out. That will be included in this. But also, the uh, it's not just the content that's being updated. It's also the app that's being updated. So we've taken a lot of time and we have uh, heard a lot of feedback. And um, we are now in the process, well, it's already been designed, but now we're in the process of developing some key features that have been requested by us internally and our users. So here are the updates that we're making to the interface and to the features of Musio. So the first one is just going to be an elevated control surface. We got some feedback and our users wanted a little bit more intimate control and elevated control of some of the inner workings of each instrument. So we redesigned the right bar to have an instrument specific section, and uh, we're gonna bring out, you know, the, the necessary controls for, for everyone to be able to compose with. And then moving down here, as you can see, the, sorry, this is a kind of a, a little bit messy, but it's the behind the curtain. This is our design doc that Maddie and I worked on. Um, but we have developed brand new effect algorithms, so new reverbs, uh, new distortions, uh, and more than distortions, also stomp box kind of things like bit crushers that help work with our um, vintage synth museum content and our digital content that we develop in house to make it more flexible, you know, to work for video games and 8 bit kind of stuff. So that is all coming. It's been designed, it's being implemented right now. And um, one of the bigger ones that we've had requested is multi mic and multi mix positions. So currently, Musio just gives one full mix that we think sounds amazing and great, but uh, we have implemented and are now, uh, well, we've designed, but we are now implementing this mixer section. So you just have access to all of the sounds that were captured session by session. Um, it's not going to cost any more on like downloads or anything like that. It, they'll behave the exact same way as they do right now. You'll just be able to pick and choose what you want to download. So it's not so heavy on your machine or on your hard drives. Um, and then the one that I'm most excited for is we have now finally built in and are going to implement key switching. So this will provide agile functions, you know, between certain articulations on a certain uh, instrument. So if you want to go between legato and sustain and staccatos, uh, you don't have to have separate tracks for them anymore. Now we're going to be able to enable key switching. And when we've done a good job of just taking key switching down to the bare minimum of like, what do we want it to actually do? What do we like about key switching maps in other libraries and in other platforms like our contact libraries? And how can we implement that the best way here? So we've taken enough time and we've really designed it down to what we like. And we are very, very excited to be offering this in the next few months as well. So there you have it. It's a, it's a lot of new content that's coming up, a lot of new features, key features that are coming up, and new layouts and stuff that we've designed uh, just based on all of your feedback and what we really want Musio to be. So um, make sure you sign up, make sure you jump in on this amazing opportunity. It's a crazy good deal and we just want to take the journey with you starting now. So uh, come and be a part of the development process. Come along with us as we get all this amazing stuff finally out and usable. Uh, we can't wait. Hope you can't wait either. Can't wait to see what you guys write and create with this stuff. Uh, hope you're all doing well. Have a good one, and we will see you on the other side.